everyone and welcome to the mini toy love channel and today I have a teeny genies themed video for you guys I'm really excited to be opening one of the new series four packs they have the Zara corns and look at how many and adorable they are I also have the larger floating genie palace play set which that looks awesome um, you get a floating genie in each of these large packs and then I have a series one pack that I never got around to opening so lots of cool stuff the shimmer and shine uh, teeny genies are one of my favorite mini dolls they're so well themed and colorful and nicely detail for something so tiny so let's go ahead and get started first up let's open our packs and then we'll have a lot of fun little figures to, to put in our genie palace so here's the series one this was pack number seven you get the floating genie in the middle as well as two little mystery ones you get your two little blind bags and first up is our floating genie and she is from the music divine she shine <laughs> so she's gonna be one of the ones that should levitate with the little magnet in back and she's holding a flute and look at her little face. They have such cute expressions, their tiara, their eyes are gorgeous, and um, their heads turn, or you could say their, their bodies turn, <laughs> especially with her and her big hair. Now she has having trouble standing up because she's so top heavy. And then we have two from the dance party. We have cute little Shimmer, looking adorable, with her foot up and back and her eyes closed. And then, oh, she stands too. This is Nora. She's also from the dance party. And I like her double pigtail ponytail. And she has a clear finish. So again, their little heads can turn. Cute. And they do have little holes in the bottom, so there must be some pegs on the play sets. Which I can't wait to look at later. And then we have two friends divine. One is, I think you pronounce it Leah. One of you guys had mentioned that. So she's cute. She appears a lot in the various series. I like the star. Um, on her tiara necklace going on and then we have this little cutie this peacock is Roya and I've seen um, her in some series as well and then our last visible is this cutie now I had trouble finding her on the checklist I think she's from the magical market and her name might be Farah um, but I couldn't really find her on the checklist so you have the rainbow sparkle categories but she's holding a gemstone and has a little vest, so that kind of threw me off. Let me know if you guys see her or know who, her character name. You also have Genie Splash, which that's super cute. And then you have Magical Market, which some of them are holding gemstones, but she has a little vest, so I can't, the hair doesn't match up. I can't seem to, to find her. Um, on the back, you have the Dance Party, then Music Divine. So she looks like Farah with the split uh, ponytail thingies going on in back. And then you also have the Dreamy Genies, as well as the Friends Divine. So those are all the different categories in Season 1, or Series 1. Will she stand? There we go. And then we have two mystery ones. So our first little cutie. Ooh, she's totally clear. So it looks like she's going to be a rainbow sparkle. And this is Manal. And look at how cute she is. She has like her tongue sticking out. What an adorable um, little facial expression. All of them are just so different and unique for being so small. And then our second little cutie, oh, she has flippers and a little inner tube. So she's definitely gonna be a genie splash one. And this little cutie is Dahlia. She looks super cute. I can't tell, it looks like she has an elephant floaty. Okay, that's pretty adorable. <laughs> so that was our awesome little series one pack. And then we have the series four, and this is pack number 11. I like how they are numbered, um, so that way you can kind of keep track, but it has this pink Zara corn, of course the two mystery ones. And look at, she has a cupcake, she has a sword. I think series four has the pirate category. Okay, can't wait to see the checklist. Here's a look at the super awesome checklist for series four. These are so colorful and well themed. So the first category is the tea party, which looks adorable. We do have one. I like how you get a variety of the different uh, series. Then we have what might be my favorite is the pirate splash. Look at how fun. There's a couple mermaids thrown in. What? That's awesome. Then we have the fruity genies, which those look super cute as well. There's the Zara Mae skies. Oh, look at these little rainbow ones. On the back, there's more, more cuteness. Oh, Zara Mae Skies continues. So these are continued. Um, then we have Carnival Magic. 
which looks so fun. Look at her shocked expression there. That is adorable. We have a popcorn one. And then we have the Zara Corn Surprises. And look at how many Zara Corns there are. I did. I had no idea. There's some on clouds. You get these two little cuties dressed as Zara Corns. Yeah, those, those are a lot of little miniature ones. And I love them all. Oh my goodness. And then you have the Friends Divine. That's a, reoccur a reoccurring category for favorite characters. Look at this cutie. He's, he's new. Okay, you get your two little blind bags. They're purple in series four, which those are really pretty. And then first up from the tea party, we have this little cutie. She's a floating genie. And this is Gem Princess Ula. U-L-A if I'm pronouncing it right. And look how she's holding on to the cupcake. She's adorable, my goodness. She stands really well too. And then we have Shine from the Pirate Splash. Oh, how cute is she? Look at the little cheesy grin. I love their facial expressions. She also has like a little captain's coat and her sword. Very, very cute. Yeah, the, the Pirate Splash. That's an awesome little theme. Oopsie, we're gonna scoot everyone back and knock them down. And then we have one of the fruit genies. Look at how pretty she is. She has like a little lemon wedge and it's clear and glittery. And this is Nissa. And I really love the detailing on her little tiara. She has her tongue sticking out, which is absolutely adorable. And she has like the split double ponytails. So cute. Then we have the Zara May Skies Shimmer, which she looks adorable. She's winking, sitting on a little pink moon. She has some star details going on cute then from the carnival theme um what was it called carnival magic look at her i think that's a popcorn bucket this is zeta so cute also with the winking face happy expression <laughs> and then our last visible is our zara corn and look at how cute she has the little star details around the eyes and the wings are clear and have that very graceful design. I have glitter on me um, that the Zara Corns have. And this Zara Corn, they are named, which I didn't realize that. This is Deliza, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. And she has like a little pearl finish too. So cute. And here's a quick little size comparison with another Zara Corn. Um, I noticed the little detailing on the wings, and they still have that detailing for such a small figure. And it looks like the minis, they can ride on the larger ones. Okay, so who's this blue one if she's on the checklist? I'm curious. That's so cute. They look like little babies. So is this Zundust, maybe? Or it might be... No, I think it is. She has like a little mini form. I'm assuming I might totally be wrong, but these were like the bigger ones that came out with a little teeny genie in a previous series. Okay, those are adorable. Okay, and then we have our two little blind bags, so we're not done yet. So first up, oh, we have, um, what's his name, Nahal, and this is from Carnival Magic. Looks like he's playing the drums, I think. Oh, he looks so cute, and he's been in every series, and just look at, again at the detail. Um, they're so pretty. Okay, and then our other little surprise. Ooh, who do we have? I think it's a little tea party, and how cute. She's in a teacup. Like, literally, and I love her design. This has a cool Alice in Wonderland vibe going on. So I believe this is Princess Samira. And she's absolutely gorgeous. Wow, what a great pack, and I can't wait to open more of this series for. And I'm on the hunt for all the Zara corns. <laughs> and then last up, I have the Floating Genie Palace playset to unbox. I did pick this up a while ago on clearance at Target. Um, so definitely never opened it, but I can't wait to put our little minifigures inside. I think it'll also make a pretty cool way to display your little mini teeny genies. Okay, so this playset is super cute. There's a ton of little pegs and places to display your teeny genies. It also comes with this little table and a magic lamp. It has two little beds, a bathtub, and a throne that you can put your non-floating teeny genies on and they'll still levitate. So up here, you have this lever, which if you hold down, so this is where the magnetic ones go. You have like this little diamond area. So you can set one of your floating genies there and then you would press down on this lever and then watch them float. 
and then they pop up on the balcony. How cute is that? Oh my goodness. So let's say our little teacup one, she's not magnetic, but you can put her on the throne there. Okay, and you need to make sure you have room to pull the lever all the way down. There we go. And you kind of see the magnet grabs the throne. And there she goes. <laughs> okay, that's adorable. It doesn't take any batteries. It's just sort of a, a little crank mechanism that does that. Okay, that's adorable. And then up top here, sort of out of view, we have this area that spins and you have a cloud with the magic carpet. It can fit two little teeny genies up top. And then you also have this little gemstone where you can store some of the teeny genies inside. So how fun and interactive is this adorable little playset? And it has so many spaces to store your teeny genies, which I really like. Here's another look at everything we opened today. You guys will have to let me know which was your favorite little teeny genie character. Leave me a comment down below. As for me, I really do love them all. I'm, of course, super excited about the little teeny genie mini Zaracorns. Those are adorable. But look how fun the fruit ones, the little cupcake tea party set, the sparkle genies. There's just such a cute variety. And yet again, such cute detail with their faces, their expressions, the jewelry they have. Just very, very well done mini toys. And I love them. So that'll do it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out my blind bag playlist for more fun toy surprises. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.